two, three. So now when you put you know a bandage or a coating on the skin, you know it's there, you can feel it, you can see it, and sometimes it can even be uncomfortable. What we've been able to do is create a cream basically that you could put on the skin and then once it's on the skin, it can actually form essentially an elastic second skin. This, you can start. This is D3O, okay? So what D3O is, is a non-Newtonian fluid. And what that means is it's a fabric that absorbs impact. So it's very soft, but upon impact, it goes hard. So it's very soft to touch. And if you look down here, it's very soft. But if I hit this, it goes rock hard. So how do I demonstrate that? Well, if I take a lump of this, and then I get maybe, I put my finger here, and I, I use this, actually no, fuck it, let's use this. So now if I go like this, I'm gonna chop my finger off, so I'm not gonna do that. So I'm gonna use a lump of steel, and I'm gonna hit my finger with a lump of steel. Normally that would break my finger, but actually because D3O, it absorbs the impact. D3O into the inside of the case. So look for the orange line, you can see it. Now what does that mean? Well what that means is you don't break your phone anymore. So if I was to drop my phone on the floor, it doesn't crack. Can crash. you show it again? <laughs> it doesn't crack. Oh my god. So it doesn't crack and it doesn't crack the screen. I can throw this as high as I like and it doesn't crack the screen. Well, what because because it absorbs the impact. The challenge with designing an ingestible robot is finding biocompatible materials uh, that are easy to be controlled and amenable to the types of operations that are needed from the robot. To demonstrate how the robot works, the researchers folded the structure into a capsule made of ice. The ice capsule travels down the esophagus into the stomach where the ice melts away and the robot unfolds to its functional form. At this point, the robot can be controlled by an external magnetic field to do work such as the removal of a foreign object from the body. For example, every year 3,500 swallowed button batteries are reported in the U.S. alone. The tiny batteries are digested normally, but if they come into prolonged contact with the tissue of the esophagus or the stomach, the batteries can burn the tissue and become embedded. Now, using the team's new robot, the battery could be removed without surgery. Once inside the stomach, the robot could be directed to attach to the battery it could lift the battery from the stomach coating and then eliminate it through the digestive system. Locate the plug and plant in a sunny wall. Plant your plugs. Enjoy the beautiful process of watching them grow. Then cultivate fresh and nutritious vegetables. Thanks to Plug and Plant's modular design, you will be able to connect as many panels as you like so you can transform any space into an incredible natural ecosystem with a wide variety of species you can use for culinary purposes, decoration, or even to grow your own medicinal plants. Hello. My name is Thomas. And this is Nabid. We are inventors in the Lemelson M I T student prize competition
reality, where digital meets physical. We spend huge amounts of our day interacting with others around us. It is a central place to sync any type of device and to display its content from all sides. You can play games with family, connect across generations, work together cooperatively, or compete head to head. Make education an engaging experience.